Hey, it's Pacey Cage, and I am back with my alphabet challenge. We are on to character E, and that character is Elizabeth from Bioshock Infinite. Infinite. Infinity. I don't. I don't even know. Right. So you know the third game, uh, but I, I really struggled with choosing a character for character E because nothing was really jumping out. I did consider Eurydice. 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 There's a lot of words I'm struggling to pronounce today. But either way, that lady from Hades. Although I decided I'd save some characters for Hades for later because I don't really want to do too many characters from the same franchise. So, you know, if I'm going to do a character from a franchise, I'm going to make sure I really, really like them. But then again, that can't be said because uh, I don't actually care that much about Elizabeth anymore. I used to though. I, I did really like Elizabeth back when I first played the game. I thought she was cool and funky and fresh, just like a deodorant. And um, yeah, either way, yeah, I thought she was cool. Uh, and I actually did do a very bad drawing of her like three years ago now. I don't even know. Either way, it was it was pretty bad. Uh, but I did put it on the amino because, like I said, um, yeah, I used to use amino a lot. And I have gone back to it recently, like I said in my last video. I almost said episode. <laughs> but yeah, I, I did. I went back and back in the day, I used to write a lot of blogs on... I'd basically just like analyze parts of the game and I wouldn't really say it was much of an analysis. I basically just went through uh, like the plot of certain parts of the game, but also I'd like explain uh the history behind certain characters like i did one on lady comstock and i didn't just like you know restrict it to infinite i also did it on i think i did it on the lutesses which are also from infinite but yeah i did one on a uh, tenenbaum yeah i did one on tenenbaum i did one on santa cohen i did one on i can't remember his name andrew ryan yeah i did a lot and I was going to remove them but I decided not to because they used to get like featured when I was on there and I was so proud it was just like you know my crowning joy clowning glory clowning crowning glory oh god either way uh, I'm messing up on my words and it's probably because I just want to get through this video so that I can hurry up onto the next one because yeah I, I've struggled with character E I didn't really feel that passionate about it and I think maybe that's why the drawing suffered a little like the course it could be a lot more detailed and you know there are just more things that I could have tried but I didn't because I was just like let's get this over with so I can go into character F and just keep going because this is actually the furthest I've gotten in a alphabet challenge before so I don't want to slow my roll uh, but yeah that's how we landed upon Elizabeth and well, yeah, I just kind of want to get her out of here now. I'm done. <laughs> I'm so done with her. I'm, I'm going to go and do my character F and enjoy that one. Not that I didn't enjoy this, but like I said, it was more of just like a doing it because I have to. And uh, yeah, I'm posting it here now so that I may move on. But I've also been working a lot on another animatic. If you watched my first one, that's if you're a South Park fan. This new animatic will also be a South Park one. And I'm trying to... I'm trying to put in a bit of an animation to it, you know, rather than it just being image after image with some fancy transition slide that isn't even that fancy. But either way, uh, I'm learning, I'm moving on, I'm doing new things. And uh, to be honest, I hope you stick around for that. I hope you just enjoy my channel and I hope that you, well, I also hope that you like and subscribe because it's nice. I, I've been really enjoying the comments I've been getting lately as well. They're just really nice. And I didn't think that I would ever get that kind of support and I'm very appreciative, so yes, thank you so much for being here, and I hope that you continue to be here and see me in the next video.